This is Nate Adams with Energy Smart Home Performance, and I want to show you another cool feature about the, the Carrier Infinity thermostat. Uh, it is how you can see how much power your system is using. So this system was installed, I think it was completed about the end of June. Um, but if you see the energy tracking button here. So you can set your energy pricing. You have to pick a cost per kilowatt hour. Um, it's a little bit high for Cleveland. Uh, here, this is a Cleveland Public Power Territory one. They're a little bit higher than uh, the other local ones. So have it set at 12 cents. And then you can watch uh, energy usage. And this is really pretty slick. So it's uh, it, the tracking what the system is using. And I like that it separates it by cooling, heat pump, the fan, uh, electric heat, which is uh, 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 backup heat and electric reheat which I believe is used uh, when it goes into a defrost cycle so if you have a heat pump it will freeze up literally and so periodically it has to defrost itself and I believe that's what that's tracking there um, so uh, for the month of August and September uh, and it is now October 8th so these are the last two months uh, you can get an idea of what this is using now this house is unoccupied so it's not using a ton at the moment uh, that's about the change, but uh, uh, you can see that for cooling, it's using pretty minimal amounts. So just figure 10 cents a kilowatt hour in your head, even though it's 12. So that's 11 bucks and that's 10 bucks for cooling those months. Um, and then the fan costs you know, four bucks and about a dollar 20 to run for the month. So uh, if somebody tries to scare you about energy usage of continuous fan, if you have a high quality unit uh, with a, a good variable speed fan, it doesn't cost that much to run them. Uh, but uh, it's just nice that you can see these things. You can also select uh, what it's used for the year. So it's used 400 kilowatt hours. So 40 bucks at 12 cents, you know, a little bit more, $44, um, uh, but not very much. And then you can see what it's doing this day and yesterday. So it's really a pretty slick little system. And I like having this because it's a good way for me to get an idea of what's going on uh, uh, you know, as time goes on. And uh, since I make predictions of how much energy I think the house is going to use, this gives me an idea of whether I'm likely to hit that estimate or not. So another cool thing about a, a Carrier Infinity thermostat.